Most of you probably know my friends Edwin and Ethan from Grindhard Plumbing Company. And back in June, at the Gambler 500, they let me drive their Power Wheels Jeep. You want to catch me with the greed in your words I'm keeping me captive, put locks on the doors and then, Edwin asked me this. So are you gonna build one now? I'm not that talented. <laughs> oh, you can do it. Uh, My welder's help. garbage, I don't have a bender. I'd love to, though. But you Something have like it. <laughs> I have friends. And just, we need more people with these. <laughs> and, as fate would have it, a few weeks ago, I came across this beauty at the dump. An old flat fender Jeep Power Wheels. And this got me thinking. I've got another cart project on this channel you've probably seen that I need to finish. So, I still don't think I'm talented enough, nor do I have the right tools to pull it off. But this is Dirt Garage. We don't have a real garage. We lay on our backs in the dirt to work on stuff, just like anyone else can do. So, I guess let's make a Power Wheels project. You guys have seen this project before. It's not new here. No, it's not abandoned. Yes, I've only made two episodes. One of them doesn't really matter anymore because I've changed my mind. This is my, like, kids ATV chassis go-kart thing. The idea is, I'm gonna slice it down the middle, and then I'm gonna separate both the control arm mounts out so that we have room for a motor in the middle. See, as you can see, I just got a bit of like scrap metal up there, down there, holding it together. This is just, just for concept. Um, just mocking it up. I still don't have the motor here, so I don't want to go too far ahead with supporting it and make permanent stuff. So this is what we got. I guess I just want to see if, how the body looks, how it fits with this suspension setup. All right, and that's about it that I'm gonna do today to this thing. Um, so far, it's actually looking pretty good, and it's looking like it's gonna work out good the way the body fits on this IFS chassis. Anyways, let me know what you think of this thing in the comments below, and uh, yeah, if you like the stuff, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Peace. Peace.